Three, two, one. Woo! Oh, lights. <laughs> Clean green electricity. Thank you. Well, we're celebrating the wrap up of BC Park's 100th anniversary here at Golden Ears Park in the beautiful rain, which is, of course, part of the BC tradition. And we uh, lit up a Christmas tree with clean green electricity uh, after investing $1 million in an underground cable to connect the park into the grid. Uh, and that, that replaces four uh, dirty diesel generators that used to be used and of course saves us a lot of money, $40,000 a year in fuel costs and of course the air is much cleaner without those uh, that carbon pollution going up into the atmosphere. So kids from the environmental school were here today helping us celebrate singing some Christmas carols. Jerry the Moose is here and we're enjoying some uh, Parks 100 birthday cake along with some much needed hot chocolate. Um, it's perceived that as the head of this organization that celebrates Vancouver and all of its awesomeness that I've got my finger on the pulse of everything new and exciting happening within city limits. And while that's true, uh, whenever I'm asked about what my favorite thing is about Vancouver, it's, it's always the proximity to nature and how easy it is for all of us to get out here on, on a day like this or, or any day and, and to enjoy, enjoy this park and these protected pieces of land and facilities on them that are part of what makes not only Vancouver and the Lower Mainland awesome, but all of our province. Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer, reindeer, you'll look out in his story like Elvis. 